President Trump is banning TikTok? <laughs> what? Did you just hear the news? Now, this is a wake up call. Business owners, this is for you. Hey, it's Jay. Welcome to my channel. Here we talk all about business tools, tips, and strategies to boss up your business, have fun, and live the life you desire. But this is something that just had to get on and have to and had and decided to make a quick video because this is a reminder for us as content creators, as business owners who utilize social media social media we use it as a platform for our business every single day whether it's you know facebook instagram linkedin you know um TikTok, youtube and we assume that these platforms will be here for us at any given time all the time but we have to remember that these platforms are borrowed rented space and at any given time it can be removed from us because we do not own it and that's why it is so important think about this you know president trump put a ban on tiktok giving them 45 days and what's going to happen is you know if you're in america at least okay if you're in Canada or uk or whatever it may not, not going to be a ban but if you are in america when you go to open up your app it's going to say this app is not supported in your country. Anybody who's ever traveled abroad, you know, if you use Pandora or anything, you tried to use it in Mexico or different areas, it'll say your this country doesn't support this app. So that's what's gonna happen. And what will happen is all of the hard work, all of the time, energy, you know, videos, uh, uh, viewers, subscribers, followers that you had, you will no longer have. And so, I'm coming here to remind you that as a business owner, it is so, so important for us to take the conversation off of social media and to bring it back to a um, forum that we have a little more control over. Whether it's a blog, whether it's an email list, whether it's, you know, your website, something that you can bring in those eyes, those viewers, those prospects to your medium where if there is a situation you can always mass email contact send your ideas your thoughts your promos your you know your gifts to your prospects clients followers at any given time i mean think about it think about how snapchat was a form that you know a couple years ago Everybody was on Snapchat, like growing their business crazy. And then Mark Zuckerberg wanted to buy Snapchat and they didn't want to sell it. And then he came up with Instagram stories. And now a lot of people don't even use Snapchat for business as much. We have to remember that it is so key and important to be able to bring our business off of the form that we, you know, that we love. Okay, we can grow. But make sure we have something that's going to uh, capture their information, email, something so that you can always reach your 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 um, your clients and your prospects and your customers. And however, if you do have a mass following on TikTok, because the beauty of TikTok is that you could really get so many eyes in such a short amount of time. I think he said you have about 45 days. Now something could change by then. Something can change by then, but I think it said it's about 45 days. So what I highly recommend is all your videos that you have, download them. As many people that you have on your TikTok, start doing some calls to action, saying, hey, you know, um, if you love, you love me here, follow me here, send them on to another forum, whether it's YouTube, Facebook, whatever you have. Make sure you're capturing their information and being able to still take time and reach out to them because you don't want all your hard work to be done. You don't want all your hard work. I mean, there are people building courses around how to utilize TikTok for business, and now they have to scrap it, at least if they're in America. Possibly. Who knows what will happen? So, you know, just as a reminder, again, remember how Facebook went down for a few days or a few hours, and everybody was like, oh, my goodness, I can't get to my clients, I can't get my prospects? You, as a reminder, you never want to have any forum that is not something you own your only way of making money number one you always should diversify right 
and also be your only way to communicate with those who really love, trust, enjoy, you know, who you are, what you bring to their life, you know, the information of valuable content that you, valuable content that you bring to them. And you don't want them to not be able to get in contact with you and vice versa. So please take the time now, you know, if you are on TikTok, you might want to read all of the different nuances that's going to be coming up, all the different rules, so that you can make sure you fortify your business or even your followers, even if it's for fun, making sure you still have a connection with them on another forum. And again, as a, as a business owner, to make sure you diversify the platforms that you're on and also have some type of way for them to bring it back to you, to have an email marketing list or something like that. If you never had an email marketing list and you're looking about ways of how to do it or a place where you can you know, figure out how to make emails, I'll put the link below of an email marketing system that I use that can help you. Um, and you know, best wishes. And I hope this was helpful. As always, laugh, love, live tight to the fullest. Feel free to check out some of my other videos um, so that can help you in your business and as you grow. And as always, thank you and have a great day.